Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my 100% walkthrough of Fallout 4. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we're going to be finishing up McCready's questline. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. We're going to go into Malden Center first. Let's crouch. Turn on our Pip-Boy lamp. Sensor reading detected. Gonna have quite a few cents to kill. Engaging. <coughs> Systems offline. <coughs> Targeting. Upper limb actuator shutting yeah. down. Now he's just starting to have fun. Going to make our way over here. Is someone present? Following institute protocol. Eliminated hostile. We're splitting all Stop that, right? Fascinating. Let's go down this elevator. Going down. <laughs> Found you. <gasps> Careful, there's oil on the floor that will catch fire. Grab the fusion core that's right here. My target has disappeared. Hello. Did not mean to pick that up. It's all right. Not that big of a deal. Detected. Curious. Oh, he's gone. Critical failure. Destruction of Got a couple of raiders to take down. <laughs> They're really not that hard. gonna come over here pick up our last tumblers today magazine hell yeah should have no problem picking locks at this point and then we're gonna come over here for a cap stash that's on the floor normally it's right here but apparently it flew off from an explosion or something and then we're gonna come up here Follow this around. Go ahead and loot this stuff real quick. Going up. I don't know why I love opening up the hatches. It's just fun to watch the elevator go up, I suppose. Right here was a door that was locked. I didn't show it everybody I just kind of walk straight down here but this is where we first entered the Malden Center saying all right we can stand up I don't know why I crouch we don't need to crouch yet we're just gonna follow this road around to Malden Middle School We're going to be exploring Vault 75. 
This is where the gunners are from. Go ahead and turn on our pit boy lamp, crouch, and go inside Malden Middle School basement. Hop over this. We're taking casualties. <coughs> Take out these gunners. <coughs> oh my god, you got a minigun? That's terrifying. That was a little bit scary. Nice. Ooh. It's a pretty good minigun. Probably gonna have to throw some of this onto McCready. Because we'll get over encumbered. Keep firing. Going down. So we're gonna get the side quest Volt 75. Lower level. It's pretty much we're just going to explore Vault 75 to complete this quest. It's really not that difficult. I think we have company. I love looting these suitcases. That way I can get some more stuff for my settlements. Floating purified water that's always here. Apparently, uh, Bethesda didn't deem it necessary what? to <laughs> fix that bug Let's or glitch. Do here. Sweet, we just got a level. We're going to put it into science. And then the next one is going to be toughness. And then we'll go back to science, toughness, science. Where I heard something. We're gonna try to take out as many gunners Last now as we can. Should be one up top here. If we come over here by the reactor, we can take out two gunners. Who's there? One's right there. And then the other one. Should be over here. You're dead. Take him down. Turn around. Head over to the showers. You can crouch again. Over here, we cannot open this door just yet. No use, not without a card. We're gonna be finding the card here in just a moment. Get some! This won't take long. Ah. Right over here is a terminal. You can play a little mini game to see if you can beat the gunner's sure time in this shooting range. Pretty cool. <laughs> We're gonna go in here and grab the Volt 75 lab access card. Now we're going to backtrack. Come on, McCready. Move out of the way, bud. We can stand up for a minute. There's no enemies over here. Hang a right. Then come over here. I missed the door. It was to the left. 
Sorry about that. Can't open this door yet. Need to find the card. But we can open this one. This leads out to where we took the elevator down into Vault 75. Let's crouch again. Come back for you, bud. <coughs> find him, find him. Ah. A waste of time. Find anything useful on him? <laughs> Lucky rolling pin. Not really that useful. You're dead. <coughs> We're gonna grab the <coughs> trash him. Lady, we're gonna grab the Volt 75 admin access card and then we're gonna grab the science bobblehead. Bingo! This is going to allow us to get one extra guess when we're hacking terminals. Pretty good to have. Just wanted to see if I could shoot that light off, but apparently I could not. Never tried, but it's worth trying, right? We're going to open up this door now. Let's crouch. What? Just punch in the air, huh? Go ahead and lockpick this door. That's it. Come over here, grab the overseer safe key, and then you can use that to unlock this safe and loot it. Grab the Grognak the Barbarian magazine. There we go. There's another safe right here. And then all we need to do is go in this terminal and we complete the quest. If you want to read anything in that terminal, you can. We're going to hang a right here. This just brings us out to the overhang. Is where we killed the gunners earlier when we first entered the vault. We can hop down here, hang a right. There's that floating purified water again. The infamous floating purified water. Then we can come up here and exit Vault 75. Be really careful when exiting out of here. Some of the gunners did escape and they put some traps down for us. There's also some frag mines over here. We're gonna head this way. We're gonna crouch just in case there's anything over here. We don't want them to see us even though I'm not very stealthy because of my Pip-Boy. I think I've said that multiple times now. 
What? We can try, right? We can try to be stealthy at least. We're coming up to the MedTech research facility. MedTech research. I hope some. You hear that? Got quite a few ghouls over here. Go inside the med tech research facility. All right, let's find that executive terminal. Sinclair said that's the only way we can override the facility's lockdown. We're gonna come over here, come around, take a right. There's gonna be a ton of ghouls in here, so be ready. And when I say in here, I just mean in the whole place in general. This is a ghoul that's down there. If you want to root through this mess, go right ahead. Come on. Do make sure McCready is following you, because if he's not, then you need to get his attention or get him to follow you in some way, because he's going to give us the password to get into this terminal. Could not proceed without McCready. Barrel over here. Oh, big mistake. Check the terminal on the desk over there. Sinclair's passcode better work, or we're screwed. Go into this terminal. We're going to go to alert override off. Thank God that worked. Let's find our way down to the sub level. That's where MedTech should be storing the cure. We're going to head down here. And then we're going to use this terminal to open up the door. out and then we're going to use the terminal again to open up the door on the far side over there it's gonna say i know there's ghouls over here My advice to everybody, take some Radix. I'm feeling eyes on my back. I'm all over this! Impressed yet? There's another ghoul right over here. I was hoping we could get by him without being seen, but apparently not.
if you want, you can open up. Wow, I know that was a. Okay, whatever. I was pretty sure that was a legendary. Doesn't matter. You can go into those terminals if you want, open up those doors, and put those poor ghouls out of their misery. I'm not going to bother with it. Head downstairs here. McCready should uh, pop into existence here soon. Or not. Okay. That's weird. It's alright. We'll give him the cure later. He'll stay out of our way for now. We're going to head over here to the terminal on the far side of the room. But before we do, let's go ahead and lockpick this security gate. Yes. There is a security helmet you can get. It's the same one from, or the same type as the compound has. We're gonna open up the doors. Just be prepared to fight a bunch of ghouls once you do. Gonna come over here and then right over here we're gonna head down some more ghouls take some more radix we'll grab this fusion core Oh, we don't want to head up there. We want to go this way. We can stand up. There's a ghoul behind us. Take him out real quick. Ghoul over here. Then there's a ghoul over here. We're going to open up these doors and we're going to have three ghouls. One's going to be a glowing one. We're going to come over here for our Massachusetts Surgical Journal. Bingo. Let's loot all this stuff. And then right here is what we want for McCready. This is the prevent. Perfect. And then just be careful for that fusion reactor or whatever it is. We're going to go to this elevator and head out and then we'll talk to McCready. Unless he magically appears in this elevator. These elevators that get dark and then lighten up. These are load screens, quote unquote load screens. So we'll see if McCready pops into existence. did not so we're gonna have to exit out and then he should be out there we'll crouch and then we'll go out to the Commonwealth 
There's McCready. Just make sure nothing is around here. Nope. Let's talk to McCready. Yo! Psst! What's up? Here you go, we McCready. Holy crap, we actually did it! We just gave Duncan a fighting chance to live. I don't know how I'll ever be able to pay you back for this. I owe you big time. This is a friendship, not a business contract. Yeah, you're right. I'm just used to people taking rather than giving. Maybe one day I'll realize that you're different. Anyway, the last step ahead of us is getting the cure to Daisy and Good Neighbor. With her caravan contacts, she's the only one I trust to get this to Duncan on time. This is the last favor I'm going to ask. I promise. Let's go. Let's go to a good neighbor and then we'll fast travel back over to the med tech research facility. Running from something? Welcome home. <clears throat> McGrady, I haven't seen you in a while. <laughs> You haven't been avoiding me, have you? No. How could I stay away from someone as cute as you, Daisy? Uh, you're a lousy liar. But I'll just play stupid and pretend I don't know that. So, what do you need? I got it, Daisy. I found the cure to Duncan's disease. Oh my god. That's wonderful news. How'd you do it? Last time you tried, the ferals almost chewed you to bits. I didn't do it alone. The friend here got me through medtech. Now, all I need to do is to get the cure into Duncan's hands. Can you help me? Of course, McCready. You've saved my behind more than once. It's the least I can do. It's okay. You can trust me. I swear I'll get the cure to Duncan. If McCready trusts you, that's good enough for me. I appreciate that. He's actually not so bad. Once you get to know him. I'll get the sample on the first caravan leaving the Commonwealth. The driver owes me a few favors. And he's reliable. It will arrive at your homestead in no time, McCready. Thanks. You're a doll. Hey, do me a favor. Take care of McCready for me. He's one of the good ones. We're gonna send McCready back to... Yes? Sanctuary, and then we're gonna pick up Paladin Dance from Sanctuary and head back to MedTech Research Facility. Hey. What do you want? Here you go. I think it's about time we called it quits. Okay, uh, I'll head back and wait for you. Take care of yourself. Okay, I will see everybody back at the MedTech research facility, which is right over here. That way everybody knows where we're going. And I'm heading over to Sanctuary. All right, we're back at the MedTech Research Facility with Paladin Dance. We're going to head southeast. Just grabbing the last little bit of this quest for Paladin Dance. Hold up. Let's assess the site. An explosion tore this building apart. Some kind of high yield detonation. Look at the blast crater. It's Brotherhood power armor. Look, you can still make out the insignia. The recon team was here. The damage, it's deliberate. They set the fusion cores in their armor to overload. That's what caused the blast, but why? Over here, look. We're gonna grab the Battlefield Hollow Tape and Knight Varham's Hollow Tag. Let's go ahead and listen to the Hollow Tape. Now you have to make sure that you listen to the Battlefield Hollow Tape. You don't have to listen to any of the other Hollow Tapes, but this one you have to listen to if you want to go and get into the bunker. All right, let's go ahead and listen to it now. Five to one. Bottom report. We're down to five percent. We'll have to 
scuttle the armor. We can't let them have it. Fire him! Damn it! Aspen set the self-destruct. Better slow back. We'll head for the old military base, then try to make it to our holdout. The code will be our call sign. All right, move, move, move! Choice. With no armor and no supplies, their odds of survival were low. But that was the right decision. Technology must be protected, no matter the cost. That just leaves Paladin Brandis. He always was a survivor, but after all this time. The holotapes mention a bunker. I think I know the one. It was part of my original mission brief. Let's move out. So listening to that holotape gave us the password for that bunker so we can confront Brandis. We're going to backtrack over by the medtech research facility. Take a right here. Hey, didn't expect to see you again. Take another right, going over by this blue house. We're going to go to the side of it. We're going to go get Grandpa Savaldi's hat. We're going to crouch. There's a death claw right here. It's always here. It's scripted to be here. Let's go loot the death claw. Responsible. Just have to fall down that sinkhole. These noxious fumes are quite revolting. Let's grab this wasteland survival guide. Hell yeah. It's going to permanently make our swimming 25% faster. Comic books? Kill them all! And then right here, don't forget to pick up Grandpa Savaldi's hat. Let's show them how the Brotherhood does it. Sent them back to hell. Hmm. Why is it so quiet in here? I don't like this. This way. If you want to explore more of that house, you can. Let's heal ourselves up. Stupid robot, die. Jesus. Just annihilated my health. see anything else <laughs> right over here we can get close to this pond that way we can just 
discover it. We'll hop back onto the road. We're going to be hanging a left here in just a moment. There's a Myrler Hunter right over I there. I think we're alone. Found you. Standing down. We're going to go over to General Atomics Galleria. Galleria. You must be our new supervisor. Uh, yes. That's right. Splendid. Well, let me be the first to welcome you to your new assignment. Once you've had a chance to get settled in, you should report to the director. His office is located in the statue in the center of the plaza. The Galleria is currently closed to the public, but staff and employees are permitted on the grounds, of course. If you have any questions, I'd be happy to assist you. Why is the Galleria closed? I'm sorry, but due to pending litigation, I am unable to comment. Please direct your inquiries to the General Atomics Legal Affairs Division. Who's the director? General Atomics Patented Director Management System, DMS, is responsible for coordinating the actions of the robots here at the Galleria. The director allows the Galleria to operate autonomously, without the need for human intervention. What is this place? The General Atomics Galleria is the shopping center of tomorrow today. Our wide array of stores are staffed entirely by the General Atomics line of robots, showcasing the reliability and versatility of a robotic workforce. Come in and experience the General Atomics difference. That's all. Very well. Enjoy your visit. General Atomics is certainly pleased with themselves for designing the Mr. Hand. We're going to take the elevator up. Mafia wasn't accepting applications, but I do my best. That's just what a commie spy would say, smug bastards. Just what are you up to? Who are you working for? I want answers! Wait, the grand reopening? Are you grand reopening supervisor 18 Alpha? You're late. Yes. Yes, that's right. Manual authorization of the grand reopening requires authentication, so I'm going to need to see your ID. Sir. Uh, here. Scanning. Scanning. Error in scanning subroutine. Identity accepted on a provisional basis. Accessing protocols. All units, stand by for the grand reopening. Processing firmware updates. Done. Reinstating combat inhibitors. Done. Designating new facility supervisor. Done. The General Atomics Galleria is now open for business. As the grand reopening supervisor, you will be conducting tonight's customer appreciation raffle. Here is the grand prize. That'll be all, soldier. Dismissed. You can use the pre-war money in all of these shops to get different stuff if you want. You can even use it to bowl. So if you have a bunch of pre-war money saved up, go bowling, um, go to Fallon's department store, wherever you want to go. We're going to backtrack, pull our weapon out.
And we were... And we're almost done. Let's hang a left here. Be really careful. We're going to have a rad scorpion pop out just to our right. Pop out again, hopefully. Oh, it's over by dance. Dance, quit messing around. Kill the rad scorpion, dude. You never know what you'll find. So we're gonna hate. So we're gonna head straight north. We wanna head towards that red and white tower. Be prepared to fight a couple of blood bugs as well. Nothing too serious. No prisoners. I heard something. Let's activate the radio tower. And then we're going to face east. Head straight east until we get down to the road. Make a left onto the road and we're going towards that dirt road. And that'll take us up to the bunker. Cars in the tree. Pretty interesting. Looks like we got some super mutants over here. Stay vigilant. Let's go ahead and go inside. Paladin? Freeze! One more step and I'll, I'll, I'll blow your damn heads off! Paladin Brandis? Who are you? Who sent you? How did you get in here? Calm down. We're just here to talk. Talk? Why? Who sent you? What are you doing here? It's Dance. Paladin Dance. Don't you recognize me? Dance? No, 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 no. That can't be. Why... Why are you here? I was dispatched to the Commonwealth on a recon mission, Paladin. Just like yours. How did you find me? I've... I've been alone. All alone. For so long. We followed the distress beacons left by your team. Their holotapes led us here. The others? What, uh... What happened to them? They're dead, Paladin. I recovered their tags. You... you... you did? Thank you. This... this really means a lot to me. I tried to go back for them, you know. There was nothing I could do, not alone, but... But I'd hoped you have been through a lot to find me. I should... I should give you something. I've collected a lot over the years. Technology, odds and ends. If you see anything you want, take it, take it. Come back with us. You're still a member of the Brotherhood, Paladin. What? No. No, I couldn't. Not, not after everything that's happened. The Brotherhood needs you, Paladin. It's time you reported in. I... I, I can't. It's, it's been too long. I... I wouldn't be of any use. No one knows the Commonwealth better than you. We need your help. I've been here too long. I'm, I'm, I'm not myself. Would they still take me? Now, before I do the last one to rejoin the Brotherhood, you can choose the reward for him or from him, not for him, from him. And you'll get a really cool weapon. 
but I think it's better to have him rejoin the Brotherhood. Plus, Paladin Dance loves that. The Brotherhood will honor the memory of your team. Shouldn't you be the one to tell their story? Unless I go back, their, their sacrifices, everything we went through, it'll be forgotten. I can't let that happen. I'll do it. For them. All right, I'll, uh, I'll get my things. Head to the airport. Thank you. Thank you for everything. We'll talk to Paladin Dance in just a moment. Let's listen to Paladin Brandis' holotape. Brotherhood of Steel Recon Team 429 Alpha. Final report. Our mission has failed. Six hours after insertion, my company was ambushed. We lost five nights and exhausted our power armor reserves. We scuttled the armor to prevent looting, then retreated under fire, abandoning our supplies. I was separated from the two remaining members of my team within a week. Both are missing. Status unknown. I'd hoped to rendezvous with them at our holdout bunker and seek a means of escape from the Commonwealth. But no one has come. No one has come. Let's speak with Paladin Dance. Hey, ready. Paladin Dance. You handled yourself well, Knight. I appreciate the backup. Of course. Paladin Brandis is a good soldier. He deserves better than this. It may be a long time before he's fit for duty again, but I'm glad to have him back. Captain Kells will want to hear about this. Let's report in. Then we're going to come over here and we're going to end the video. I want to start by telling everybody thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. It really does mean a lot to me. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night, whatever time it may be in your part of the world. Mr. John Wayne, signing off.